The show must go on and no better place for the famous Walenda family to practice what they preach than in New York City. Yeah, Nick Walenda and his sister are back in the spotlight more than two years after that eight-person pyramid crashed to the ground. What a, mm -hmm. what a scene that was. It hurt several of them, as you know. News Channel 8's Avery Cotton joining us in studio now. This could be an emotional return for the family. Yeah, for many reasons, too. Nick Walenda spoke to us today and told us that he's always wanted to perform something major in New York City. He says that's the first place his family performed when they moved to the States back in 1928. It was the fall that shocked the world. February of 2017, the famous Walenda team lost footing while practicing their eight-man pyramid. Liana Walenda was one of the five who hit the ground under the big top. You know, she broke every bone in her face and internal bleeding, broken arm, broken leg. They didn't expect her to live. But she did. And now she and her brother Nick will attempt to make history. New York City is a city that never sleeps and never stops. My goal is to stop that city for at least 25 minutes as I'm on that wire. Their plan is to walk high above the famous Times Square during a two-hour special live on television. We're going to start on opposite ends. Uh, she will start where the ball drops. I'll start over on the opposite side on the Renaissance. We'll cross over in the middle. I'll step over her and we'll cross into the other side. The duo will be 25 stories high and will walk 13 feet across Times Square. Nick is a producer for the special and will be hands-on when it comes to safety, even rigging his own equipment. While he says he's never seen this video of the fall, he admits it does go through his mind when his feet hit that wire. But this is a job he loves, something that is truly part of him, and he won't let that fall keep him from what he was born to do. Fear is a liar because it tells you that you're safe, and the truth is fear often keeps some of us from our greatest goals and achievements. Nick and Liana will walk across Times Square on June 23rd, and it's been a big ordeal planning this. Nick says he's had to get permission from around 16 different skyscraper buildings to make this walk. And of course, always important to remember they do not do this without it with a net underneath them. So, yeah, Woo. yeah. that's going to be something. Yeah, not going to be on our channel. No. Yeah, well, no. It'll, it'll be on Facebook. We'll, yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll watch it. On Facebook. We'll still watch. I have a feeling yeah. it'll trend either way. Yeah, exactly. Thank you, Avery. Thanks, Avery. Still ahead, new cannabis rules at the airport.